my beautiful people. Sweet Sadie J coming back at you. Hope everyone's having a wonderful, it is still Friday. I did a quick little Dollar Tree run today and I just wanted to come on and share this. I am filming all of these videos on the same day because I'm on a roll and I'm not sure yet whether or not I'm going to muster up the courage to go to my friend's wake tomorrow and go to her funeral on Monday. So just in case I don't get to film anything, I'm trying to stock up. So I hope you guys don't mind seeing me in the same um, clothes. They are clean. So anyway, all right. So the first thing I'm gonna start with is the refrigerated stuff that I got from the Dollar Tree. And I told y'all I was going back and getting me some spring rolls because I love these things. And I probably will go back and get some more of them throughout the month because, you know, they're just a dollar. And this is not part of my grocery um, budget. So my Dollar Tree hauls are my special little miscellaneous money. So I got two of these, the vegetable spring rolls. That's the only kind they have. I keep forgetting to look in Walmarts and um, all these to see if they have the shrimp rolls because I really love those. But I also got um, two bags of my chicken pot stickers. Let me see if I can find that thing. Chicken pot sticker. The that the, the, the Google chicken and vegetables pot stickers, and I love these things. And I bake them most of the time, but the other day I decided to um, fry them because I still had some grease left over from the chicken strips that I had fried. And I like them baked better, much better. So maybe, I don't know, maybe I overcooked them, I don't know, but I ate them anyway, but I think I prefer them um, baked. So that is the refrigerated stuff. I will be right back and come back and show you the rest of the stuff. Let me get this in the freezer. Okay, my beautiful people, I'm back. Looks like my lens are dirty again. I should really check that before I turn on the camera. Okay, ooh, this bag is heavy. Y'all know I still like to use my little ice cream cone bag, especially when I have heavy stuff. I did quite a bit of little food shopping today. I don't know why, but I don't know, just stuff to tide me over. So I saw that they had the little four pack of Oreo cookies. And so I said, well, you know what? I'm tasting an ice cream sundae of some sort, some type. I have the waffle cones and they're really, really good. But I was thinking crushing up some of these Oreos, like two of them for serving and using some caramel sauce, whipped cream. I have mar maraschino cherries in there. Mmm, sounds good? Yeah, I know. So I bought one of those, and I really, really like these little ones. It's four packs, two cookies per pack for a dollar. Not bad, right? And I needed some more spicy mustard for my salads. And so they had this here at the Dollar Tree for um, oh my, my things keeps moving. Sorry, y'all. So they had this here. Um, what is it called? Deli Market Spicy Brown Mustard. So I got that. Okay, and one dollar. And I picked up a thing of baby kosher dills because I really wanted to try the spicy, the spicy pickles but they had too much sugar in them, so I couldn't, um, I didn't want to try those. So I got the kosher dill, which was a bigger jar for a dollar. So I got this jar for pickles to have with my sandwiches. I dropped something, I felt like I dropped something. And then of course, I wish they would carry the low sodium ones, but that's okay. I only eat a few of them when I make my salad, so I got some, sorry about that y'all. I got some black olives. Sorry for my nails. These are the ripe large olives and they're really, really good. Oh my God, I love them in my salad. And then I picked up another small thing of Velastic Sweet Relish. Now I usually get the Dollar Tree brand y'all, but they had Vlasic there. I was like, what? It was a smaller jar. The Dollar Tree um, jar was much 
much bigger well a little bit big it, i think it was like this one is get glasses let's get glasses hold on for a minute y'all this one is 10 fluid ounces and i think the dollar tree one was like 11 so maybe it was just a jar that looked bigger but they have plastic y'all the plastic relish like we get in walmart's I was thrilled. So this is for my pasta salads, my macaroni salads. I'm getting ready to make a cold pasta salad because I made macaroni salad a couple of weeks ago and I ate on that every day. I just changed the meat. So I decided to get a box of the penne um, pasta for my pasta salads. And you, of course you get 50% more. So. I got those. I had a um, box of macaroni in my cart, but I still have macaroni in the pantry. So I wanted the penne for just specifically for my pasta salads, my macaroni salad and stuff like that. Okay, let's see what else we got today. I didn't really see a lot of new stuff, you, you guys. I was looking, I'm still thinking about maybe taking a ride up to... Um, Franklinton maybe next week and checking out that store but I really hate to drive all the way up there and then they end up having the same garbage that you know the Dollar Tree right here down the road from my house has so anyway I just thought I'd share that with you guys <laughs> I bought some Glad some Glad sandwich bags I don't understand that the square disappears okay so these had 29 or they're supposed to be 22 and you get a bonus seven free bags so you get 30 percent more free so i don't know if you guys can see that but they're just the sandwich bags and i use these a lot you know so i like getting the bonus i i stood there for a few minutes looking until i found the bonus pack so <laughs> and their name brand I only saw one novelty uh, pen today that I was interested in. The other ones didn't really thrill me. And that was the cute little unicorn with the butterfly on the back. And he's long and he had the tip. So I was like, Uni it just says unicorn pen. And it's so cute. And they had all different colors. They had yellow, blue. I think I showed you guys these before. But I just got one to add to my novelty cup over here with my novelty pens, the collection. And I got, let's see, another pack of my Cascade um, pods for my dishwasher. And they have four in here for a dollar. I got those. And then I finally, finally found the Cascade dishwasher cleaner where you get two for one. And this, just um, put it in your dishwasher and run your dishwasher and it's supposed to clean your dishwasher out. So, I said I really, really wanted to give this a try. And if I could get two for a dollar, that would be fantastic. So, uses, let me see what else it says, y'all. Hold on. It says, great format, great value format. You get two uses, helps eliminate lime scale, easy dose packs. Okay, let me see how many times you should use it, how often you should use it. Um, I'm probably going to do mine once a month, but I thought I could see. What did it do? It says each concentrated pack dissolves quickly and completely in water. Um, make sure your dishwasher is empty. Simply place one pack in main dispenser cup and close dispenser door. Let let it do the cleaning. A second pack may be required for machines with heavy buildup. Recommended use once a month, every month. Yep. So I thought that was a great deal for once a month to clean my dishwasher out because I have been using my dishwasher a lot more than I normally do because, yeah, I'm just lazy. <laughs> I'm just tired. I don't feel like it. After I do my cooking and my cleaning and everything else that I'll be doing, I don't feel like doing them dishes for so I'll be filling up my um 
my dishwasher, but it's okay. Now today I found these two photo props and I don't remember seeing them on anybody else's channel, but that doesn't mean that it, it hasn't been aired, but they're called photo props and one was had um, Hello Sunshine and this one had Girl Boss and Girl Power. And if you could see them, they've got the props on their shirts I don't know if you guys could see that or not. Can you see that? So this is what they're called. They're called photo props. And you get two of them. And they got them on their shirts. Okay. And this is what the stickers look like. This looks like. I'm trying to see if you guys can see that. Girl Boss and Girl Power. So I thought that was really cute. I should have got the Hello Sunshine too, but I said I would start with this. So it says, awe-inspiring, perfect for BFF selfies, fun times, etc. So I said, let me try them, let me try them. And then I found these stickers, which I just saw on uh, Pretty and Flawed's um, haul yesterday. And I love these. And I saw a lot of the other ones, but I don't really want to overdo it. So you get 68 in, in here. 68. And then you see them. They have like cupcakes, cup of coffee. Um, I don't know. All kinds of little different cutesy designs. Tea kettles. And I guess those are don't. Oh, those are macaroons down here. Those are macaroons, and so I thought they were very colorful and springish. So every month when I write my rent check, I always decorate my envelope for my landlord, for my property manager, and she just loves it. So I that's what I use those stickers for when I buy stickers like that. But I found some of these flower sack towels, and I just couldn't resist. And I'm hoping I didn't already buy this one. But I know I have the one with the KitchenAid mixer on it because, you know, I love that one first. But this one says, roll with it, and it has the rolling pin on it, and that is so darling. And I do not use these towels for anything other than just decorating my oven door. That's it. And this one I'm going to wait and use for Thanksgiving because I love this. And I only found one, and it says, all about that base. That base, that base, it's all about that base. But I thought that was so freaking cute. And I said, oh yeah, Thanksgiving, this will be on my oven door. And the last one I found, which was different from what I've been, you know, seeing, this one was What's Shaking. And this is so darn cute. So you got the salt and pepper shakers and it says, What's Shaking. I thought those were so cute. So I love these. So I definitely, definitely will be using these to, to decorate my oven door. And that's all I use them for. And I think the last but not least of what I, oh Jesus, I dropped something. Hold on for a minute, guys. I'll be right back. Okay, sorry about that. I dropped one of these soaps that I got. I found the Peony and Plum. Now, I know I didn't need these, but you know what? I had to get them. I just had to because I had been looking for them for a while. And they had the other one, but I knew they were going to run out by the time I got back there. So I might find them at another Dollar Tree. I don't know. We'll see. But I got this one, and I didn't even smell it. <laughs> I'm so smelled out from my bath and body work. Ooh. Oh, yes, it smells lovely. So, I love soft soap. So, I got that one. And then I got the jasmine and the mint. And if you could see that. This is the jasmine and the mint. Okay. And that's kind of like a bluish color. And I didn't even smell this one. So, very nice very very nice so just soap to put into your um your bathroom or i might just even you know put them in gift bags 
for the holiday or whatever birthday's coming up. And of course, you know, I got my regular little box of tissues because I have to keep my tissues on hand. And when I'm sitting right here where I'm sitting at, I always like accumulate a lot of garbage. So I decided to just purchase a little waste basket to sit right here underneath my table out of sight so that I'm going to put a I'm going to line it with a plastic bag and then just, you know, put it right here so when I'm sitting here and I'm doing my bills, I'm reading my scriptures, everything that I'm doing, I accumulate garbage like I got it piled up right here. You know, I can just throw it in this little um waste um, basket and I mean for a dollar why not right so make my life a little bit easier so that I think yep is the end of my little quick Dollar Tree haul I hope you guys enjoy watching sweet Sadie J coming back at you love peace and happiness please like comment and subscribe and thank you all so very very much for watching and supporting my channel i love all my new subscribers you're all so very very welcome thank you thank you thank you remember guys be kind to each other the world is big enough for us all and also remember god loves you and so do i thank you guys have a blessed day bye bye